characteristic of the wild canines of oral tradition, jackals it seems had ustricht. Researchers have found what they are calling concrete evidence that a species of golden jackal living in Africa and Asia is actual two separate species, marking the first discovery of a new canine group in over 150 years. That's at least according to a study recently published in the journal Current Biology which details how scientists have completed the most comprehensive genetic analyses of the golden jackal Canis aureus ever seen. The results, they say, show that the rare African variety is actually its own species closer related to the gray wolf and coyote than the jackal. To our surprise, the small, golden-like jackal from eastern Africa was actually a small variety of a new species, distinct from the gray wolf, that has a distribution across North and East Africa. Robert Wayne, an evolutionary biologist at the University of California, Los Angeles, said in a statement. Klaus Peter Koepfei, the study's CEO first author added in an interview with Reuters that, in fact, his team found absolutely no sign of the actual golden jackal throughout Africa, showing that there is a possibility the species never inhabited those lands to begin with. Despite their strikingly similar resemblance to the continent's golden wolf, still, it should be noted that both animals are still species of canid, a group that includes wolves, coyotes, and jackals. Thus, they do share a common ancestor, a lineage that led to the rise of gray wolves and coyotes, and one that the Eurasian golden jackal split away from 1.9 million years ago. The researchers determined that the African golden wolf split away from that same lineage some 600,000 years later.